Time could stand still But just slow down What greater thing for two persons than to feel that they are joined together to strengthen each other in labor, to rest on each other in sorrow, and to help each other in need, to share joy and to be one with each other, whatever life has to offer. This is a special celebration for Megan and Brody. We will long remember, and because of this, they are thankful that you are here today to share in their joy. Who gives this bride in this marriage? Jackson and <laughs> Megan's mother and I. <laughs> Megan, will you take Brody, whose hand you hold, choosing him alone to be your lawfully wedded husband? Will you live with him in a true state of matrimony? Will you love him and comfort him in good times and bad, in sickness and in health, honoring him at all times and being faithful to him? I will. Brody, will you take Megan, whose hand that you hold, Choosing her alone to be your lawfully wedded wife. Will you live with her in this in the state of true matrimony? Will you love her and comfort her through good times and bad, in sickness and in health, honoring her all at all times and being faithful to her? I will. You're gorgeous. Megan. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And that I am choosing to share my lives. And that I'm choosing to share my life. <laughs> journey with you. Journey with you. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. With the pledge to love you. With the pledge to love you. Today. Today. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Always. Always. And forever. Forever. Brody. I give you this ring as a symbol. I give you this ring as a symbol. Of my love. Of my love. And that I am choosing. And that I am choosing. To share my life's journey with you. To share my life's journey with you. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. With the pledge. With the pledge. To love you today. To love you today. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Always. Always. And forever. And forever. Megan and Brody, you have pledged your faith to each other and the company of your wonderful families and your circle of friends. By the power invested in me in the state of Nebraska, I now pronounce you man and wife. You may now kiss the bride. You have to back. Oh, what? Oh. What? Oh. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I am proud to present for the very first time Mr. and Mrs. Brody Mashmeyer. everybody could be here today and uh, we have so many people from all over the country basically and it just means a lot to us that you guys mean so much to our family and our daughters to come to this great event I just want to say that we're so happy that Brody has joined basically two families cheers toast to Megan and Brody and uh, hopefully a long marriage and many many grandchildren <laughs> I'm gonna feel this in the morning I don't care right now I'm gonna keep this party going So light me up So light me up So light me up Now Megan is really, um 
um, truly the best mixture of my parents. She has my dad's kind heart and willingness to drop everything and help someone when they need it. Um, she has my beautiful mom's hard work ethic and ability to make a friend everywhere she goes, as you can see by the abundant amount of bridesmaids that she has today. Family has meant absolutely everything to us. And Brody, you have felt like family since the beginning, since she brought you in. And also, I just want to thank my parents and Rob and Kathy for putting on such a beautiful event and raising two wonderful human beings. There's nothing I can tell you that you don't already know. And what you don't already know doesn't really matter because you guys have each other and that's all you really need. And you guys are such a great pair and I'm excited to see you guys grow and flourish together. Uh, I'm here for you today, tomorrow, and in the future, and I wish you nothing but the best. So with that, prost to Megan and Brody. Prost!